Hi, in this lesson, I'm going to show you how to edit individual links, but also how to edit the quick links web part. Let's go ahead and get started. We have to go up here to the upper right and click the edit button to open up our page so that we can edit our quick links. Now, let's start by editing an individual quick link. Let's go ahead and let's select employee handbook. You see, when I hover over it, I get this gray bar and there's two icons here. We're going to click on the edit one. And when I do that, it opens this up and I can change anything that's in here. In fact, what I'm going to do is call this employee handbook library. I'm going to add that to it. I could change and pick a custom image if I wanted. It showed me this one. That doesn't make any sense. But if I click this, I can look for other images, none of which are appropriate. I think we're going to just stick with the auto-selected image. I can add alt text for that image. And I'm just going to do something like library. And I can add a description if I wanted to. Although it would kind of be redundant, but I'm just going to say that this is the employee handbook documents all right and that looks pretty good now let's go ahead and let's go back over here to our quick link section and let's say that I want to change the order I want to change what order these links are in I would like to put all of the web links at the bottom so I'm gonna come over here and hover over the first one the link to Sherm and I'm going to grab this icon. And you see when selected, I can use the control up arrow or control down arrow to reorder items. Now I can do that or what I prefer to do is I'm going to hold down my left mouse button and drag my mouse. You see that blue line? Wherever I move that to, that's where that link is going to go. It's here in between the employee handbook and learn about a team site. And when I let go, that's where it's going to be. All right, I think that this one is just the way I want it. So I'm going to click Publish. Yeah, that looks good. Now, I want to go to our public site, and I want to do a little editing over here as well. I'm going to go to my Edit button again, so I can open up our page, and I'm going to go to our Quick Links. Now, what I want to do here is show you that I can move this web part to another part of the page. I don't want to do that but I can edit the web part. I'm going to click there and see it opens up the layout options. Right now we're on list, but you see that the name of our document here, the business development manager job description, it's a long name. It kind of gets cut off. So let's look at some of the other layout options and see if we can't make that look a little bit better. We'll start up here with compact. You see what it did? It kind of squishes everything together but it also made this wrap so all that text can fit in a smaller space. We have film strip. Yeah, I'm not real crazy about that, but for certain things, that might work well. I can do a grid. Yeah, I'm not crazy about that either. Buttons, now buttons aren't bad. It puts a box around the link. It makes the entire thing a button. Or I could do tiles. And again, tiles isn't bad, and it might be good for certain types of links. But I think for our purposes, the one I want is compact. I'm going to go with that. Now, I also have the option to show the image in the layout. If I turn that off, and again, personal preference, but I like to have the icon there, so I'm going to leave that on. I'm going to publish. And there we go. So now you know how to edit quick links. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you next time.